my sharkies and welcome to a brand new stream that I, I know has been very anticipated for quite some time. It's Paper Mario Bro! Let's get it on! Dude, hey, calm down, Yellow. Also, Paper Mario! Paper Mario! Paper Mario! <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you, you bros are, are happy to uh, have me doing this game again. Shit thing, bruh! Even if we aren't in it. Ain't close enough, bruh. At least, it, at least the game exists. Yeah, and then, and then I'm sure can see Jackie Bay and our music club mate. Uh, and Jack and Poodle are gonna have a great time watching, ya. Yeah. <laughs> indeed, indeed, got my fine friends. We got a most marvelous stream today. One of the greatest games ever made. Even more marvelous than me, you could say. Mm -hmm. That's something, Gunrid. Anyways, what don't we up with? We got one more. Oh, hey, watching Ben, you're just in time. We were just getting things started. Indeed. Why don't we go ahead and uh, do that before you use up all the Russian accents? <laughs> Indeed. Let's go ahead and get this party started. Oh, Hello Kitty g video game in 2025. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I forget. Uh, nearly forgot in case y'all uh, didn't know. There was a Nintendo Direct today and there was a Hello Kitty game of all things. Among other amazing things like a, a new Mario and Luigi, a Zelda game where you get to play as Zelda. As well as... We finally got to so see Metroid Prime 4 after seven freaking years! I do mean that literally. It has been seven years since that game was announced. Oh yeah, the Shire. And there's also a uh, a uh, game where you can play as a hobbit and uh, live a quiet life. Uh, my, mo my mom's very excited about that. Anyways, uh, just uh, we're here on my Switch screen about how to get to the game. Just uh, showing you a few stuff I've, I've been playing lately. Uh, let me know if any of these games in particular interest you. But now... There it is, chat. The, the game that Paper Mario fans like me have craved for years. I want the Hello Kitty game. Yeah, it, lo it looks adorable. Also, I don't know if you noticed about that game, uh, Sakakoto. I think they actually just have all a whole lot of different Sanrio characters. Like, uh, y'all ever see that anime? What was it? Ag Agrexco? It was like, that was like an anime about like an office worker, uh, Red Fox, who like, Sang heavy metal. I, I noticed she's in that game, so yeah, that should be fun. Anyways, yeah, maybe I should have done an E3 stream. Anyways, it is time for the thing that broke the str that broke the internet on the last stream of e of well, not either. It's a red panda. That did I say red fox? Uh, yeah, red panda. That's what I meant. <laughs> uh, sorry. Anyways, and I'm gonna do it on uh, this file. You know that. Since uh, that way we can see all the new goodies, good stuff without any of my prior files spoiling anything. Anyways, let us begin! Uh, yeah, brah! Oh boy, Chad, you, uh, you see I've uh, got some new stuff off to the side, so... <laughs> oh, but at long last, after practically a decade of waiting, we can begin and... And actually, now that I look at those stories, I love to go It is now time for Paper Mario, the thousand-year-old door. That's out of way. Me, me. Just notice the chat's uh, oh, not quite. But yeah, I'll let y'all just uh, drink this in while I adjust things a little bit. Uh, but yeah, they actually changed the intro a little bit, seeing as there's just Paper Mario himself on the screen. Hello! But that will not remain for long, chat. Let us begin. Oh, and uh, where shall we be? Which chat will sh Which uh, chapter? The uh, I can't talk. Uh, we'll do the blue one, because uh, blue is my favorite color. Surely that won't get too confusing. Huh, well, weird. You used to be able to enter your name. Anyways, let's begin, chat! Oh, so magical and nostalgic this moment. <clears throat> Today, I'm going to tell you the story of the Thousand Year Door. An awfully long time ago, 
In a strange and far off land, a big bustling town was there. It was a town where all people lived very happy lives, and it was said that the town was very prosperous. Woohoo! Indeed. But one day, tragedy befell this town. A great cataclysm struck the town and its people. Darkness filled the skies, and the earth roared and shook. It was as if the very world had come to a violent end. And in but a single night, the town sank into the depths of the earth. Many moons rose and set. <laughs> Stories of the town passed into the pages of fairy tales. And when the town's site no longer held relics of its past, people gathered at the spot and built a new town. Oh, sorry, I'm tearing up. But word soon spread among the people who moved in that an ancient city lay deep underground, and that a magnificent treasure rested there. It's the end of the world! Pretty much. Indeed. This is the tale of the fabled treasure of Rogueport. Yes, this is where it begins, in the sea. The tale of a quest for the legendary treasure. And the Thousand Year Door starts here! I'm sorry, just don't... Gets me tearing up every time. That's so good. Oh, would you look here? Oh, who do we have here? Finally! I have a minute without Toadsworth watching over me. He's so paranoid. Oh, can you blame him? Oh, he's the princess. I came all the way here on holiday only to be stuck with toast. Toadsworth, it's so stifling. Is that a noose? Yes, it is. There's a reason they call this place L Rogueport. Once in a while, I'd like the chance to look around on my own and see what I want. <laughs> but uh, now that I'm doing it all, all I see is that town is a very flamey flavor. Oh, mystery! Mystery! And this goes. Oh wait. Oh sure. Now let's. Now let's. Gives me a moment. Well, to you buy something, I have a wide assortment of knickknacks and doodads. But this is a special favorite. Hmm. Wow, that's a pretty box. What's inside it? This box holds a map that shows where to find a treasure. With that box has a magic lock on it that will only open for a pure and noble heart. As you can see, it, well, it won't so much as budge if one such as me touches it. It's a scam? Uh, maybe, I mean... Ooh. I mean, you... Yeah. I mean, considering where we are, that's not the... That's... Uh, that could be true. If this box will open for you, Missy, then you may have whatever is inside. <laughs> Go on, hold it. Well, I suppose I could try to open it. <gasps> oh, oh my gosh, she actually did it! <laughs> Meanwhile, at the Mario Bros. house. Hey, Paracary! Who's that again? He was one of the partners, bro. Mario, see you later, Mario. Hey, who that? Hey, Luigi. Oh. Hey, look! There's actually a picture of the old partners. Oh, good times. Y'all remember when I streamed that? Yeah, that was like uh, pay the original Paper Mario was the second game I ever streamed. Anyways, back to let's get uh, back to focusing on the story. Hey, Mario Bros. Hey, bro, check it out. A letter from the Princess Peach arrived for you. Oh, Ooh, let me see. I'll just read it to you. How's that letter sound? Okay. Now, hey, man, let us see here. We <clears throat> need to think about after this. Hello there, Mario. I'm now on holiday, traveling in the Mushroom Kingdom. In my travels, I came into possession of a mystical map! A treasure map, actually. 
It was inside a box I got from an old merchant in a town called Rekkerport. But since I, it would be too difficult for me to try to go find the treasure all by myself, I thought that you could help me hunt for it. You will, of course, won't you? I've included the, the map with this letter, so please bring it when you come. I'll meet you at Rockport. That means you must come. Beach. <laughs> oh, nice impression. <clears throat> what do you know? It's a true. There's a weather on the map in here with the letter. Check it out. Okay. Oh. Would you look at that? <laughs> Would you look at that indeed? <laughs> And with that map begins the greatest Mario adventure of all time! Oh, um, I'm gonna be getting so tearied up this stream, sorry. Just Paper Mario, the thousand year old door! This is literally my favorite GameCube game and pretty high in my top 10 video games. Off to the sea! Prologue! A rogue's welcome! Look at that, we got a coin with Mario, Peach, Bowser, and whatever that might be. Hmm. Here we go! Excuse me, sir. Please, wake up, sir. The town you've been speaking of has come into view. Look, that's Rogueport. Oh? Oh. oh! You see, we arrive shortly. Please prepare to disembark. Well, I remember first seeing this game in a in a demo uh, at Sam's Club. I couldn't really figure out how to play it, most of it, but uh, it was still amazing. I figured out eventually. Look at this nice little tugboat thing. I must apologize, sir. Our arrival was delayed by a bit of rough weather. Are you sure, quite sure you want to disembark here? I, I did tell you all the sordid tales about ro Rogueport on the way here, did I not? Don't worry, I gotta go see the princess. What's that? I'm uh, sorry, you say there's a princess waiting here for you? Is uh, that so? Um, of course, sir. Well, if uh, that's what you think, uh, then I won't stop you. But uh, you, you be careful, sir. No, don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, and flip! Uh, <laughs> here, get me out of here. Hmm, well, how about that? Oh, hello everyone! Welcome to the first Paper Mario uh, Thousand Year Old stream on the Blue Sharky 3 a channel. Isn't it a wonderful? Ah! Mahoo! Wow! Okay, that's uh, that's why we go by boat, no, not the swim. But yeah, welcome to Rogueport, everyone! Oh, hello! Good to see you all again. Eh, I don't really got any buddies with me this time. Other than these uh, pirate bombs around here. Oi! Welcome to Rogueport! Bit of a nasty place, eh? You got guts coming here. You look a bit green, so, eh, uh, so I have a wee bit of advice on me. Hit that save block to save. Because, uh, the thing about life is, you never know when you're gonna, we're gonna kick the old bucket. I love the these. Uh, this is true, Paper Mario. Look at all these great designs. Uh, nice sailor toads and these piratey bomb bombs. Those are so amazing. What do you want, pal? Huh? A princess in a pink dress? I ain't seen nothing like that. No, I don't remember a princess. Probably. What do you want? The, want this chick? Anyway, pal. Oh, your money? Or she your girlfriend? Also, a funny thing I found out you can do in this game. Yeah, you could just attack the locals. Hey, what do you want? Get away from me, freak! Uh-oh. Oh, what do we have here? <gasps> oh, come off it! I know you're a nosy book, book nerd, so don't play dumb with me! I've seen you walking around town asking for information about the crystal stars! Well, no, I'm doing the ask I know! So be a good little student and tell us what do you know? Right now! Never! I don't have anything to say to you, creeps. Ew! I suppose it would not, it would not be right if a sassy little like ass like you met with a untimely end. Oh 
Oh dear indeed. Boys, we're taking these firebrand to our fortress. As you command, Lord Crump. We're on it. No! Stop right there! You hear us? I'll scream! Really? Oh dear. <laughs> Out of the way, you scallywag! Move your ever living booms! Hey, what's going on here? Ah! Wait. Like, I'd go any with you! With smelly losers like you! Hm, not likely! What? What do you think you're doing? You doing, chum? You think you can screw up my plans? What with who? Me? Da! Ah, he's always something! Looks like I'm going to have to give you a little taste of the old crumb bum Let's do this! Yeah. Am, I, am I doing good with the voices so far, chat? Oh. Uh-oh. Uh. Battle time, Mr. Man. Just find a way to beat this freak of, of the week, okay? Don't sweat the details. Just jump on him and hit him with your hammer. Okie dokie. You're going down, you baby! Save her. Yeah, we'll save her. Don't worry. That's what the Mario does. Alright, do take this. No! It hurts! Yes! You're doing awesome! Don't you let up! <laughs> you're no match for Lord Crumb, you stupid little... Oh, wait, what? Ah! Why you do that? You got him on the ropes! Come on! Keep wailing on him! <laughs> Why you do no damage? You don't make sense! Right, more hammer time! Ah! My flesh! It burns! Ah! Uh, the chat is slow. Sorry about that. I, I haven't gotten around to... I haven't quite gotten around to fixing that. Uh, oh, dang, you're right. It is quite behind. Sorry. Yeah, I'll... I'll try to look into fixing that at some time. Maybe, but it's just very busy. Oh yeah, I'm doing good. Okay, thanks. You did it! You did it! Yes! And you got star points. Oh, that's what these little things are. Star points. Oh yeah, not my own numbers from other game. The star points you get will show up there. When you get a hundred points, you'll go. You're going up a level. Don't forget that, okay? Oh yeah. Hmm. I. <laughs> Okay, you got a couple of decent shots in. I give you that. But unfortunately for you, that means it's go time. What? Uh oh. Oh my, that's a lot of whatever these are. Punish him! Yeah, here we go. Get up, get up. Yes, destroy his flesh. Make him beg for mercy! Ah, 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 ah. Quick, this way! Oh, okay. Phew! What a bunch of bozos! Let's just sneak out of here, what do you say? Okie dokie! Yes! You are no match for my might of Lord Crab! Punish him! Rip him to shreds! Ah, 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 ah. Bye bye! Me! Oh! Stupid! Huh? Huh? Ah! Ah! Where'd they go? Uh, yo, Johnson! Did you see them? Did, did anyone? Uh, no, 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 sir. I don't know. Where are we going? He's not time yet. I know you saw I didn't see him. Ah, you saw so your dress! What? Ah! Ah! Crud! They bolted! That's cheating. Indeed. Well, we just cheated right back. <laughs> so, yeah, you just, you gotta remember, chat, that there's a, a 30 second delay with the chat. Sorry. Well, mister, you totally saved me. Thanks. I have just got to give you a little reward. Mwah! Oh! My name's Goombella. I'm a junior at the University of Goom. Nice to meet you. Oh, what's going on back there? Yeah, lovely day, ain't it? Yeah, kinda. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's your boy. Hey, boys. You know, you know where to get it, do you? So, um, who are you? It's -a me, Mario! Mario? You mean like that famous guy? Wow, I can't believe I met you here. 
Cool! Anyway, uh, no offense, but it looks like you just rode into town yourself, right? Roof! And I really stay down, bro. The boss sends his greetings. How that rule taste, punk? Me, I already hate it here. Yeah, uh, that hurt. That hurt. That was jerks. We won't forget this. Me, I already hate hate it here. There are fakes and weirdos everywhere. It's nasty. <laughs> yeah, pay, pay pay no attention to the gang war in the background. I mean, I know this place is called Roqueport, so I should have expected it, but jeez. I never come to a place like this if it weren't for some legendary treasure here. Oh. Oh, yeah. What? You're looking for the tre legendary too? Seriously? Why is there a noose in a kid's game? Oh, uh, <laughs> good question. Uh, I may. Uh, because it's, uh, newspaper. Get it? <laughs> uh. Whoa, 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 Bucko! What do you got there? He's a map. Ah! Oh my gosh! Is that a map? You have to tell me where you got that. What oh, the princess sent it to me. Princess Peach? What? Great Googly Boogly! If it isn't Master Mario! Toadsworth! You're alive! Bit of a coincidence bumping into one another in this sort of place, hmm? Oh? Uh, for your, those who don't know. Toadsworth has been missing from the Mario from the Mario series since like Mario Party Seven, so it's so great to see him alive. He's like uh, he's he's kind of Peach's caretaker, so to say. But basically, he like like how Kamek's uh, uh, Bowser's caretaker basically uh, Toadsworth is pa Princess Peach's caretaker. <laughs> so it's so good to see him alive. Oh. oh. So tell me, Master Mario, what in the world brings you to this wretched little bug? Oh, the princess. Um, ah, indeed. Let us please send you a letter and a treasure map. Ah, she told old you she'd meet you here in Rogueport. Intriguing. Yeah, you seen that? You asking me where Princess Peach is? Um, I was about to ask you that. We stopped in this town to acquire a spot of fuel for our ship, eh? Don't you know? I'm so British. I only took my horse off for a moment, but as soon as I did, she vanished! Oh, not again. You know how headstrong she is, Mario? I just assumed she'd be back momentarily. But at this point, I fear we must embrace the possibility that she may never return. But I'm feeling better with you here, Master Mario. Surely we, we'll find her. Surely. It's not like she was kidnapped again. But I know my place, Master Mario. And this is not it. I leave this task to you. Oh, okay. I believe Eva will recline in the inn right over there and enjoy a spot of tea, perhaps. In fact, I highly recommend it. But I know if you find your, H your HP hack points running low. Just drop on in. Ho <laughs> ho. Yes. Anyways, a little rest there. Uh, they will fill up all your HP. I must say, though, the rest of this town is a bit uh, rough. Yes, rough indeed. Uh, I say. Rough. I say. Um, Princess Peach? Did he mean, like, Peach, the Mushroom Kingdom Princess? The princess who always gets nabbed by Bowser, the Koopa King, the one you rescue? Yep. Wait a second. This is wild. Princess Peach sent you the treasure map? Oh, yeah. Wow, this is really intense. Where, where could she have gone, do you think? You think maybe she got sick of waiting and went off to find the treasure on her own? Maybe. Oh, oh, I know, Mario. Come with me. One of my professors is here researching that treasure. We'll show him your map. If we start looking for the treasure, then maybe we'll find some clues about Princess Peach. Oh, yeah. Great, we're all good to go, then. Let's go, Mario. And thus, we get our first partner, Goombella! So, uh, where did I believe? There! So, yeah, for those for, uh, those uh, who remember the first Paper Mario, we, we can get partners, we get little buddies of the different Mario species. Her being uh, a Goomba. Uh, for those who couldn't tell, just because, uh, you know, you don't really see too many female Goombas in the, in the main series. But though a lot more have been popping up lately. Oh yeah, Goomba's pardon, abilities. Yeah, basically she is like a Goombario who came before her. You can press X to get it by to learn about stuff. Like this uh 
This, uh, this fella. That's Goomther the Goomba. He's always complaining about being swindled or mugged. Oh, uh, yeah, I swear, in this long text from you and you. Yeah, I can also get in X to learn about the location. This is Roadport Square. It's the center of town in the main business district. It's a crossroad where many people meet, including more than a few shady characters. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, that. Oh, uh, yeah, we know how to use Goombella. She's quite good, and she can uh, bon head bonk enemies, as most Goomba do. Most Goombas do. Mm -hmm. Alright, first off, we gotta find my professor. Thing is, since I just got to this town myself, I am, uh, don't actually know where he lives. His name is Professor Frankly, and he looks like this. Oh, oh okay. This town looks worse than Gotham City. Um, uh, pretty much, yeah. Oh, before I forget to mention it, from here on, if you ever feel lost or confused, just press XL, ZL. That'll be my cue to share any info I know, which might help us figure out. Study and pace off. Yeah, but yeah, well, welcome to Rogue Port, everybody. Oh, oh, sorry. Yeah, p pay no attention to that thing in front of the news. We can't uh, do anything about it yet. But yeah, it's quite a roguish town filled up with quite a few critters, like Goombas, Mousers, and whatever those goat guys are. They have a name, I just, I don't remember. They're not Yoshis, they're something else entirely. Hmm, but hey, how you doing? <laughs> you smell, do you smell that? This smells like a profitable situation. Yes, indeed. Looks like my star is finally starting to shine. Not that it's any of your business. Yeah, we get to see the mousers. Y'all, y'all re don't really see these guys much anymore. But yeah, this is a. But let's uh, let's go ahead and save. But yeah, definitely, definitely one of the odd, quite an uh, odd location with uh, it's quite a nasty place. Now, what do you have to say, Professor? Frankly, actually, I think a guy by the name lives over on the east side. Just go east from here, as he entered the town from there, but just hang on right. So, uh, what about him? This guy steal f something important from you or what? <laughs> yeah, these, uh, basically everyone here probably has a criminal record. Oh dear. They could have made the- ah! Oops! Pardon me, sucker! <laughs> hey, what's- what's your beef, pal? Yeah, I'm talking to you! That guy bumps into you and just runs off like that? Unbelievable! Some people are so rude! Also, he, uh... I don't know if you saw, but, um... Um, he mugged Mario and stole half our coins. Oh, no! Hmm. Well, we just need to find the Professor Frank... Oh, well, that looks alright. Alright. <clears throat> oh, boy, I gotta get another old man voice ready to go. Professor Frankly? What is it? What is it? Oh, yeah! Oh, it's me! Yeah, got a, I had a voice plan. What, what is it? Oh, yeah, tell you. Now, um, uh, you, um, uh, wait, wait, wait for it. Just wait, 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 just a moment. Don't tell me. Now, silence! I'll get it right. Get back here. Yeah, we'll, we'll deal with that thief a little later. Um, it's, it's not Goombriel. Er, uh, it's not Elizagoom. Um. Oh, um. Bow! Bow! I forgot it! You're a Goombella, aren't you? You were in my archaeology class last year, am I right? Wow! Yes, sir! That's me! I'm Goombella, a junior at you, Goom! Go Goombas! <laughs> of course, I remember you! Not to toot my horn, but I'm pretty good at remembering. You, though, uh, you stick out. What in my mind, because you were such an exceptional student. And that guy behind you is... Uh... Oh, he's me! Oh! Ah. Mario, Professor! He's Mario! You know, the famous one? Oh, my apologies. I'm such a bookworm. I haven't a clue about what's hip right now. In any case, what sort of errand brings you to all the way to a place like this? We were hoping you'd tell us about the legendary treasure said to be below the rogue port. 
I thought that if anyone knew anything about it, it would be you, Professor Frankly. I'm gonna tell you! I know about it. The reason I came here was to study that very subject. But, uh, why do you tanks want to learn about that legendary treasure? You know that, ma? Most say it's little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Archaeologists and historians have to search for the truth in those fairy tales, though. Me? I believe the legendary treasure truly does exist, and I really want to find it! Good point! Hey, wait a minute. In that case, I'll cooperate you, however, I can... First of all, we should start by addressing just what the legendary treasure is. Some say it's an infinitely vast treasure, while others say it's a magical item. Some books say it's actually a monster, while the others claim it's just an empty chest. Oh, could you imagine someone, like, just putting an empty chest in, like, a tomb or a temple? <laughs> That'd be, like, such a troll. <laughs> So many different theories. Obviously, obviously, it's impossible to divide the truth among them. But all agree on one point. To find the traitor, one must have the Crystal Stars. The Crystal Stars? To find the treasure of yore, take the seven Crystal Stars to the thousand-year-old door. That's how the old saying goes. And with a rhyme, that's sol- That's solid. Solid. That's solid. It must be true. Wait. Therefore, if you want to find the legendary treasure, you must... You must collect the seven crystal stars. Oh, hey! I researched some of the written lore behind the treasure, and it kind of matches the old saying. Hold the magical map aloft before the entrance to the thousand-year-old door. It doesn't rhyme as well. Then the stars will light the way that leads to the stones of yesterday. So much rhyming. <laughs> stones of yesterday? Is that referring to the same crystal stars you mentioned? It must be! And we're in luck! It seems the Thousand Door is located somewhere beneath this very town! Yet the critical piece of the puzzle, the magical map, is lost. If only we had the map! But we do have it, Professor! Er, well, not we exactly. Mario has the magical map! What?! Really? I hope the treasure is a lifetime of sweets. Uh, wouldn't that be nice? You, you actually have it? Go, could I take let's, a quick look at it, if you don't mind? Here you go! Ha! Ah. Astounding! This is it! The real thing! The one and only magical map! Am I doing a good voice for him, chat? I, I hope so. You, son, on my hero! Also, if, if I'm getting too close to the, to the mic, uh, let me know. I'm trying to try to go job. You're great, fantastic, wonderful even! With this map, we can locate the crypto stars just by holding it up in front of the Stasio door. Right uh, on, Professor. Good golly, what are we doing? Just sit here then. Go better, Mario! Let's take the magical map to the Stasio door! Off we must go, this is it! I'll lead the way to the sewers underneath this town. Follow me! Oh. Okay. I bet you didn't know this rotten old thing came off, did ya? Hey, here! Oh. I'm sure no one will miss it. We can use this pipe to get down under the city streets! Come on! Bad of here! Let's get moving! Okie dokie! Hey, wait! Hang on a second! Mario, something just occurred to me. I'm fairly certain there are quite a few hoodlums below, so uh, keep your guard up. Would you two like to practice your action commands before we descend? The uh, basics of battle, after all. Now, this is uh, basically, he's asking if I want to do the tutorial for action commands, which uh, it does uh, might have some funny lines, but it, it, we could probably skip it to the door. So, uh, chat, do you want me to skip the tutorials, or do you want me to do them to see if there's any funny dialogue, or should we just bolt it to the door? Uh, wh whatever works for y'all, chat. I need more tea. Hmm. I uh, see a uh, to the door. Uh, yeah, say it one more time if you want me to skip the tutorial and just get straight to uh, straight to the uh, the uh, game.
Mm -hmm. I, do, I do hope. Also, uh, feel free to tell your friends so we can get to, about me so we can get to 50 followers and I could actually do a poll in the chat. That, that'd be fun. So, what, what do y'all think, chat? Should we skip the tutorial? Or, or, or should we do it? What, what do y'all think? <clears throat> I mean, I do I really need to be asking? I, I'm... To the door! Okay, to the door indeed! No, no, Mario... No, I do. Mario, I do it again. Really? I'm asking you, are you? Maybe you ought to practice them once, just to be safe. No, I'm good. A bold young lad, aren't you? A quick refresher when your partner attacks. Much what's shown on the screen. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, basically, this is like how it works in Paper Mario 1. You push the button at the right time, you do the thing, bada bing, bada boom. It's lonely in the chat. Yeah, hopefully Epic Pikachu will show up sometime. I'm, I'm hoping we can get more people watching. Uh, you know, I maybe I should have healed first. Oh well. Yeah, again, if you have any friends, please tell them so we can get more people in the chat. I I put I posted a link on DeviantArt. I. Oh hey Sam Creeper. Well, it's not so lonely now. Welcome to the stream. We're playing uh, Paper Mario Thousand Year Door, and we just entered the sewers. Hey hey man, what's up? You think it's cool to just waltz your way into our underground? Oh, some Goombas. Typical, you service loving snobs are so stuck up. Ooh, I get to see the sun like to bring clean air. Ooh. Hey, yeah, come over here, scruffy mustache man. We're gonna teach you some proper manners. Leave him alone, can't you two? Ooh, academics and world famous hero. Can't two academics and world famous hero wander the sewers of port time in peace? Is this your usual greeting to visitors? Then you must have learned it. You must have learned it down here because it stinks! Ouch! That was cold! What, you too good for a fight? If you ain't looking to test it, then stay out of our sewer, out of the sewers. Nobody starts a fight with us! Nobody! Let's get him! What? Up, oh, sure, we gotta get to fighting. We should remix the music. And yeah, we gotta beat up some Goombas. A Goomba? A spiky Goomba? And a power Goomba! My! The hell Goomba family tree! The only one I should warn you about is that fellow in the middle, the spiky Goomba. He has spike on his head! Well, jump on that and you, uh, what, you'll be the one that takes damage. The power Goomba's on, so your hammer won't breach. You'll just have to jump for him. You get what I'm saying? Study your opponent before you choose an attack method. Now be ready for those tricky action commands while attacking and blocking. Now go get him! All right, we got... Oh, that's right. I forgot to tell you something vital. You can press 1 to change the order you to attack. You can attack fights. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, goodness, this voice is going to kill me. Okay, so yeah, we got our first... We're at the first fight chat. I'm not counting Lord Crump. And at, seeing as we have a Goomba... Yup. That's particularly smart. You know what that means. She can tattle. As in, we can find out about enemies. My favorite part of the game. That's a Goomba! Um, yeah, I'm one of those, in case you hadn't noticed. Hey, nice dancing dinosaurs. Ahem, it says here Goombas are underlings of underlings. No standout features to note. That's totally rude! Maximum team, their health is two, attack power is one, and their fence is zero. Oh, I kind of get the underling thing now. But yeah, seeing as it is a Goomba, y'all know how to get rid of Goombas. Uh, no offense. Uh, pri Goodbye. Yeah! No fair! I'm gonna get you, girl. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ooh. Perfect! Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and tattle the next one, the Spike Goomba. Well, you never see these in the main Mario game. They fit so well. That's a spiky go a Spiky Goomba? Sorry, I thought they misspelled it. Sorry. A spiky Goomba, a spiky headed Goomba. What a creative name. And two. HP is two. Attack is two, because it's got a spike. Guess that Spike House boost its attack compared to the average Goomba. The addition of the spike means you'll hurt your feet if, if you jump on it. Duh. Well, don't worry. 
Mario got the hammer. Wait, what are you doing with that? Hey, hey, wait, wait, put that down, put that down. Ah! Jump. Indeed. Ah. And that's also how we will deal with the last one right after we tattle it. That's a Paragoomba! Basically a Goomba with wings. I'm jealous! HP too. Yeah, I, I don't know if I'll read that far. You can't hammer it while it's flying, but rough it up with a job and it will totally plummet. It if it loses its wings, it does it become a regular Goomba for the rest of its life? No one ever talks about this. Ah. Uh, hey, why don't you try, Chum? Try to find out, Chummy! Okay. No, I didn't mean it! Ah! Okay, bye bye Well, that takes care of those, those hoodlums. Owie! Yeah, mommy! Ah! Oh, thanks for the money. Ha! Huh, later, losers! That felt awesome! Are you ready, Mario? There's a plenty more where they came from and they'll have it in, have it in for us. Where they attack, try to hammer them or jump on them while they're on the field. Attack successfully. Yeah, first, first strike, basically. I need, oh goodness, I need, I'm gonna need an iron throat after this. Oh yeah, that takes care of that. But yeah, ain't this, uh, can you believe this is a, uh, a quote-unquote sewer chat? It's quite something. Almost like a ancient civilization. Mm. Wait, wait, Mario, Mario, you forgot me, what that? No, wait, I'm coming. I don't know why I put that whole five second delay into the stream. I, I think it was trying to fix the frame rate or something. One of these days I'll remember to try to remove it. Hey, what are you looking at? I'm gonna. Ah! Okay, goodbye. Bye bye! Ah, no fair! But yeah, we do wanna try to do the bad lane as much as we can. Nah. So that's uh, going quite easily. We're doing so yeah. What what y'all think so far, chat? Y'all enjoying this game? It's oh, it's so amazing. Y'all don't know how great it is to actually have this game back in our lives. Boing. I'm, I'm I may have brought this up a lot on my back when I streamed the first Paper Mario. Uh, but back there there was a long time when Paper Mario went through a really bad drought of sorts. By that I mean, the games were just gutted of all creativity and just had toads everywhere. And nothing was allowed to be creative. And in the re and the one last one they did, Origami King, the bosses was the bosses were literal office supplies. I'm not joking. The first one you fight is literally a colored pencil case. You might want to delete a couple pictures tomorrow because there's something you're like, oh right, right. You, yeah, you're referring to when we do the ma the mochi mayhem tomorrow. Yeah, I already d got some deleted, but uh, I'll be deleting more. Oh, mushroom. Lovely. Yeah. Uh, Paper Mario is such a great game. Oh yes, it is, Sam Creeper. Yeah. If if y'all haven't already, I highly recommend buying this game so Nintendo knows. Make more Paper Mario. Excuse me. Well, yeah, don't worry. I'll, get, I'll clear out a lot of photos. Also, would, would y'all like me to do that for a special stream at some point? You know, just deleting photos and videos. You know, just see the games I've been playing. Oh, what's up there? Oh, oh, wrong way. Whoops. I don't know why. Okay, wrong way. But yeah, be yeah. Tomorrow we're gonna be do we're gonna be uh, doing what might be the second to last Pokemon Violet stream. We're gonna try to do the Mochi Mayhem DLC. It's gonna be great. Ah! Oh, okay. Bye bye. Oh, hello there. Ah! Oh, what do we got here? There's a, there's another thing you don't see in Paper Mario anymore. What what on earth is this? We got a, a Spinia. Yeah, this is a spinia, a totally weird creature made of thin, papery boards. Yep. It certainly looks unique. Nobody knows much about these creatures, actually. Yeah, a little, a little stronger than Goombas. Its attacks are super swift, but it should be, A.V., just give it a good hi -yah! 
Yeah, yeah, maybe I'll save that for a special stream, uh, just, uh, looking through my photos and videos, because I, I got, I got quite a few fun ones. Oh yeah, and what we just did there was the super guard. Round and round. <laughs> yeah, which is, if you, there, it's harder to do than a normal guard, but if you do it just right, you can hit the enemy back. Also, here's what go button look at do. Ha! Boing! Ah! What is it? Yeah, good, good question. Uh, Spinia is kind of just a Spinia. I think it's technically like a bunch of discs stacked on each other. Ah! But it looks like a pine cone almost. <laughs> oh boy, we can go. All right, we'll let. Uh, uh, no, let, let's let Mario handle it so uh, Gumbella doesn't have to get hit, hit by it. Mario got these. But yeah, Spinia, probably uh, a, a creature that I think only appears in this game. It's a very weird whatever it is. <laughs> what is it? Yeah, what is the Spinia? It's a Spinia. Oh. Alright. Well, it's a... Ooh, a key. Oh, would you look at that? Yeah, thank you, conveniently placed switch. Let's continue. Also, it's so much darker. It wasn't this dark in the original. What do y'all think of realistic lighting? I'm not really a fan. Oh, look at that. What's on the black key? <clears throat> yeah, one. Well, now we just gotta find, uh, I don't know, like a black treasure chest or something. Or a black door. I wonder if the thousand year door is a black. Oh, well. Oh, what do we have here? Hmm. More voice acting, I think. Hey, 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 you. Can, can you hear me? You can? That must mean you're the, the hero of legend. Oh? Only the great hero of legend can hear my voice. Yes, yeah, 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 everyone else. Everyone else, nothing. Hmm? See, uh, long ago, an evil spirit cast a curse on me, knocking me in this chest. It was a real drag. I've been in here ever since, waiting a long, long, long time for the hero to come by. So, uh, yeah, anyway, big guy, uh, what brings a hero like you to a place like this? Uh, Mario, a word with you. I'm not exactly uh, <coughs> confident that we can trust this uh, chest. I think it might be best not to mention that we're looking for the Crystal Stars. Well, drats are just dead. I just said it out loud! What's wrong with me? Oh, oh yeah, searching for the crystal stars, are you now? So you really are a hero. Well, you're definitely gonna need my help if you hope to get those bad boys. So uh, first you should uh, look for the key to this chest, then uh, use it to let me out. Definitely, totally. Not sure how this chest guy would know anything about the crystal stars. What do you think we ought to do? Hmm. Well, I know my vote goes to you finding the key. I'm sure it's around here somewhere. This is what the key looks like, uh, by the way. Come on, being stuck in a box is no picnic. I'm counting on you, oh great legendary hero. Hmm. Wait, whoa, what? You already found the key. Oh man, I owe you big. Hmm. Well, uh, we seem to have, oh, would you look at that chat? We seem to have uh, found a talking treasure chest. Who is it? Who? I don't know. I mean, it's not like we've been we've had to deal with any <laughs> nasty treasure ch living chest in the in the last game. <laughs> I'm sure nothing would go wrong if we were to shove this key on in and release whatever's trapped inside. Here you go. Yes. Thanks. Ha! Thank nothing. We up Oh, oh dear. <laughs> oh, boy, did you fight for it? I burned you! What do you think? I was going to help you? Instead, I'm gonna spread a little of the suffering I've endured in that stupid box. <laughs> yeah, sorry, but those are the breaks. I'm going to cast an evil, terrible curse upon you. Boogly woogly woo! 
your cast! Ah! Assassin need! Wee! Enjoy your curse, sucker! You got what you deserved! You wanna hear about the sweet curse I just dropped? Then listen well. From now on, if you press Y button in certain areas, you turn into a paper airplane! We do him lenient! Suffer the rest of your days under my terrible curse! <laughs> oh, I can't help but chuckle. You're doomed! This curse is pretty rough, I guess, so I suppose I owe it to explain it to you. <laughs> Ready? If you stand on an airplane panel like this, the floor will start to glow. Yep. <laughs> yeah, okay, you're on the panel now, try pressing Y. And then BAM! You're a paper airplane! <laughs> you control your tiny paper plane shelf by tilting A forward and back. The plane will rise if you tilt L in the direction behind you. However, if you keep tilting down too much, you'll slow down and start to fall back with the ground! Once you start to rise, stop tilting now. Tiny is key. Try it now and suffer the totally aerodynamic humiliation! Okay. Oop. And yep. Okay. It's not really a curse. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't I am. <laughs> when you've had enough airplane shame, press B to de de plane and get back to normal. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Shall be honest, do you fully understand the pill this curse has bestowed on you? <laughs> uh, yes, I get it. Farewell, you foolish fool! <laughs> so, um, wow, just, wow, what was that guy's beef? So, uh, yeah, that, uh, whatever was in that chest seems to have, uh, gotten a bit confused on what a curse is. <laughs> So yeah, whenever we find one of those guys, uh, we now get paper powers, and by that I mean paper airplane. Let's go, Yahoo! Well, that worked out. I uh, uh, hope y'all enjoyed my performance of that thing. <laughs> oh, ooh, and look what we have found, chat. Uh, Mario, you better look. What? Oh wait! Oh shoot! It was so epic we disconnected. Oh, hold up! Crazy man. Yep. Okay. Um, hold up! Hold it! Frankly, we uh we we lost start the internet. My curse! Don't you see? You were a paper airplane. You can't use a cell phone on an airplane. You've got no cell. Wee! <laughs> okay, um, a any moment now. Hello? C can you please reconnect? Hmm. Oh, dear, this is, uh, this is not good. <laughs> oh, dear, what, what, why is it not reconnect? Okay, okay. Yep, but Carsey Mar Murphy's Law strikes again. Okay, uh, okay, chat. So, okay, uh, well, the connection's back, but, uh... Oh, wait, no, there it goes again. Okay, so, um... Uh, because of that low issue, the frame... The delay has gone to six... To, like, a minute and seven section, seconds. So, uh... I I'm gonna try... I'm gonna stop streaming for just a moment to fix the delay. Uh, don't go anywhere, chat. We will be... Right, I'll be right back once I fix this uh, internet problem. So don't go away, anyone. Be uh, we'll be back in a minute, in a bit. Uh, let's try that again. Okay.
Oh, are, are, are we back? Is, is it working, chat? Oh, so... Sorry about... Sorry again about that. Again, uh, I kind of live in the middle of nowhere, and the internet does that sometimes. Apparently, I, uh, that curse must have messed up the internet. Yeah, curse you, Murphy's Law. <coughs> okay, but uh, hopefully things should be fixed now. Are, are we good, chat? It it uh, the stream looks good on my end. Are are we good, chat? Mm. Okay. Uh, do y'all are we good, or do do I just need to keep staring at this door? <clears throat> We're good. Okay, great. <clears throat> All right. Thanks. Thank thank you for your patience. Uh, let's keep this going. Is that? You thousand-year-old door? Oh, I can't believe it's real! Say, the legends are true! Come on, let's move closer! Okie dokie! I'm gonna need so much warm tea after this. Ooh, dang. Quite impressive. There it is, the, the, the thousand-year-old door itself. Ooh, let's get a closer look. Ooh! 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 <gasps> Ooh, it has be it has begun, chat! It has begun! Oh Professor! What's going on? <clears throat> oh Ooh, boy, yep, sorry. He's oh, He's a map! He's a doing the thing! And now we look to the to the to the to the mystical map. Oh, and look! It's been colored. What? Hmm. Ah. And it shows a castle and the first of the crystal stars, a star made of pure diamond. The location star of the crystal star has been recorded on your magical map. And there goes the internet. Oh goodness. And Mario has learned this special move you can now use. Sweet treat! Oh, ain't that neat. Can, can it bring back the internet, please? Wait, did I... Did I get... Am I on the right connection? Yep. Oh, goodness. This must be so annoying to watch on the YouTube version. <laughs> Sorry, Chad. I don't know why. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We're, we're good? We're good. Okay. <clears throat> Professor, the map, what was that with all those strange lights? Hmm, it sure looks like information related to the location of the crystal star. And that shining light, it looks as if a mysterious power was given to Mario. Sweet? Uh, yeah, something like that. Well, uh, one way or another, we should uh, return to my place and study the map closely. Okie dokie. Oh, I could use some sweets for my throat. Oh, goodness. Why did I pick such a voice for this year? Do do do. Ah, hmm. Aha! I, aha! I see! Just trying to win a cranky old man, but... <laughs> what is with you? You understand it, Professor? Of course I do! And I shall explain! The first thing to know is... This map is truly astounding! In all the caps! Somehow, this map contains a radar-like function. It's showing us the location of the crystal star. It looks like the first crystal star is, is to be found in a place called uh, Petal Meadows. Hmm? <laughs> so funny when he tilts. Petal Meadows? Yes! This area is a vast meadow that lies far to the east of Rogueport. To tell you the truth, I've always thought that place was a tad suspicious. It's sus. Nice. Is that a dark star? I don't know. The name Petal Meadows did come up from time to time in my research. Uh, okay, fine. So we'll go there. Does anybody know how to get there or what? Flowers? Yeah, it sounds... Yeah, I think petals as in flowers. Either that or it's a bike shop, but no, I'm pretty sure it's flowers. I'm fairly certain that somewhere beneath the city is a pipe to Petal Meadows. If you could just find that, you'd get there instantly. Pipe travel... Pipe travels efficient. Shay, by the way, Mario, I'm curious. How did you get that map anyways? 
Oh, the princess sent it to me in a letter and told me to come here. From Princess Peach? Really? Her Highness sent this to you, Mario? This Princess Peach, this wouldn't be her, would it? Oh yeah, that's her. Also, I, I meant to say this, I, I love how mischievous Princess Peach gets when, when Toadsworth is, is involved. It's so cute, I wish she did that more often. So it is her! Oh yeah, that's her. Your princess came to see me the other day, she wanted to learn about the treasure. I told her about the crystal stars and my suspicions about Pedal Metals. It doesn't seem likely, but perhaps she tried to go to Pedal Metals on her own! Woo! You know, Professor, there was another suspicious group asking about the same thing. Why can't we have pipe travel in real life? Oh, that'd be nice. Probably be safer than teleportation, I'd say that. And cars. Mm, but I can't imagine Princess Peach getting involved with them. Alright, it's settled! Off to Pedal Metals, you two go! If Princess Peach is indeed, if indeed went there, your first priority must be to catch up to her. Collecting the crystal stars is a means to an end, and that end is Princess Peach. Right, there you go. Are you coming, Professor? No, I'll stay in town and ask around about Princess Peach, and that's just suspicious thing. Besides, I doubt a shriveled old Goomba like me could handle the trials of the road. <laughs> of course, if anything happens and you need some advice, come and see me, okay? You got it, Professor. Well, Mario, where are you? Give it your best. Now then, allow me to give you both a proper farewell. Okay. Okay. Bye bye. Ah, Mario, there's uh, something I forgot to mention. First, uh, about the light we saw shining on you. By my reckoning, Mario, you can now perform what is known as a special move. <coughs> oh my. Oh, like a Digimon? <laughs> Oh my, a special move? Yes, it's uh, well, stuff like this is better explained by example rather than words. Would you like to uh, try it out? Uh, we're just gonna say no because I'll show you in a minute. This is very important. You better listen. I mean it. Are you ready? No, no, Mario knows what he's doing. Hmm, you're absolutely sure? Well, all right, just remember, in battle, the bigger your audience, the better. Oh, Mario, it's a scary, it's scary out there. Take this with you. Ooh, it's a metal hammer. We got the power smash. Let's heal. Oh, yeah, absolutely. It's called a badge. It's incredibly helpful. You see, depending on the badges you have equipped, you'll get much more powerful. Watch your partner's going to the effects of badge when you're equipped a badge. Would you like to practice equipping a badge? No, no, the Mario knows what he's doing. Are you happy, sir? This is the last time I ask you to take one of my badges. I see, just wait a minute, this one point from you. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, y'all know, uh, y'all are smart. Y'all know how HP and flower points work. Right, off to Pedal Metals. Uh, right. But that good idea, let's, uh, let's go heal first. Also, if y'all remember, I believe, I believe that, uh, that, that bandit that stole our money went around here. So, let's see if we can find him. Oh, hello. Freeze! You two! Not another step! Don't come this way! Some complete jerk just bumped into me and made me lose my a contact lens! I'm looking for it right now, so don't you dare move! You hear me? Whatever you do, do not move an inch! Not an inch! You hear? Okay, Mario's just got. Oh! Oops. Ah! Idiot! You stepped on it! My poor contact lens! I told you not to move! Don't your stupid ears work? What were you thinking? Oh, oh so sorry, so sorry. This is your fault! Now I have to buy a new contact lens! But you're gonna pay for it! Compensate me, Mr. Clumsy! Oh, uh, no, 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 no. Fine! If that's your plan, Here's mine, you oof! I'm gonna block the gate to the west side until you bring me a new contact lens! Yeah, sorry. Uh, but yeah, we, we can't go there. No! Look, I'm not letting you into the west part down until you buy me a new lens! So, end of story, I can't cook anything without my contact lens in. Ah! My razor's is so hot right now, I could cook you with it! Okay, so sorry, uh, let, let's go find the contact lens. 
Yeah, let's, uh, so yeah, we seem, I think, uh, oh, you know, for the longest time I didn't realize these guys had mustaches. I just thought they were like, had their mouths open like, aww. <laughs> welcome. Yes, welcome to Toad Bros B Bazaar. <laughs> Sorry. Hey, what's that? You want a contact lens, you say? Hmm, well, wait just a moment. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, I see. Oh, yes, too bad. Oh, yeah, well, uh, gee, fella, uh, I'm sorry, but we uh, don't have any in stock right now. Tough luck, I know. I can uh, special order one right away for you, but it'll take a while. Check back soon, okay? Okay, so yeah, it's, I will say this. It's uh, probably a good idea. Welcome. If you probably want to do, get that contact lens ordered as soon as you can. Yeah, and your shops have a nice point system. You buy enough stuff and you get bonus items. No mind, I understand. Yeah, let's uh, let's also stock up on a few items. Just, um, I think, uh, yeah, I think that would do for now. But as you... But if we actually look over here, ugh, we might be able to find something if we look around this this rather rubbish looking area. Like perhaps, uh, yeah, this uh, this town is quite trouble. Also, I kind of like these wanted posters. I... Sorry, I thought it was a Koopa Bro for a minute. Nah, man, but we should totally have our posters up here, bruh. All right, let's uh, let's see what's in here. Oh, oh, you you're the crook who stole my money. Oops! Fancy meeting you here. You get pretty dang persistent, buddy. What a pain. Yeah, fine, fine, okay, you got me. I'll give you your coins back. Here! Thank you very much. And don't try it again. Ah! But yeah, if you go back to that where that bandit is hiding, you'll you'll get your money back. You know, bandits are basic you now when you now that I think about are kinda like shy guys, but a lot nastier. Get back here! Yeah, we, yeah. Three skulls that cast is great. Three red jewels shine in place. It's a boom, boom, a boom festival. Three stars, brothers, master friends. Three times red stars lands on us. Blue stars, belly, four times is work. No, all the fireworks boom and crack. It's boom, past the boom festival. Can't you take it, pal? It means scram! Don't talk to me! Oi! I used to sail around on and run wild in my younger days, but I'm a reformed sailor now. I need to get need to go around ex I used to go around exploding all over the place without giving much thought. Nice. <laughs> also we got a bit of neat music around here as well, some uh, some cats drawings. Let's uh, get going to the top of the end. Three snow captain guys again. Three red jewels. Oh, where in the world could that princess be? It's quite troubling indeed. So if we talk to this nice toad uh, lady here. Welcome to the Lone Rift. You is in the part of in this part of filthiness. Our beds will soothe you. So can rest five coins. Yeah, let's uh, go ahead and heal up. Things are going quite good, Chad. I must say, we're uh, we're getting. I think we're getting close to the end of the prologue. You see, well, are you ready? Go uh, to get out there and face the world. See you again. Oh, yeah, that takes care of that. Best of friends. Oh, mamma mia. Anyways, Chad, we uh, need to we need to go track down the pipe that leads to Petal Metals now. Uh. And which would also mean, you know, getting us out of this place. Hey, you big old boob! It ain't smart talking to people you don't know. You never know when a guy might go wild and attack. Become a live longer. Oh, and oh, who do we have here? Hey, hey there, kid. You got a minute to learn what it means to fight, like fight with your whole heart. Oh, hello. I can see you breaming with potential, kid, but there's a heap of stuff you don't know about in a fight. Stylish moves, hitting it big, there's a whole list. Feel free to hit me up if you got a question, friendo. Who am I? There's some who call me the Battle Master, and I don't 
stop him, but I could with fighting. Anywho, I got a great life traveling, training, uh, some third thing. If you see me around, give me a holla. I'll take Gotham City over this place anytime. Uh, granted, there's no freaky clowns here, as far as I know. <laughs> granted, Gotham City has Batman in it, so. But yeah, that little, that toad over there, he's actually new to this remake. He's the Battle Master. He's basically for ca pa practicing your moves to do better and stuff. Yeah, pretty neat that they actually added something brand new. Ooh, I can't do much here as of yet. Hello there. My name is Dazzo, and I collect star pieces. The more I collect, the happy I am. So, Gaia, if you have any star pieces, I'll trade you my badges for them. Yeah. Oh, yeah, so star pieces, these are these little extra things we can find. If you change your mind, oh, come on. If we find star pieces, we can trade them. Uh, we'll, we'll talk to that person later. Okay, goodbye. Right now, I think we need to start getting out of this sewer. Still a lovely sewer. I'd have quite good memories here. But if you remember, we uh, we found a paper... We've got the paper plane power. Here we go! Hey, what's going on? <clears throat> but yeah, I think it, we might be able to find the... The uh, pipe, if we go investigating, um, what? It's, uh, appears to be a tentacle of some sorts. Kind of soggy and me majorly gross. Hmm. Hmm, seems to be almost inviting us to do something, doesn't it? But what? Hmm. What, what do you suppose this is, chat? Any... Any suggestions on what you think we should do? Well, you know, I, I got a feeling if Epic Pikachu was here, he'd be something like, That's it! I'm getting me mallet! Squid? Boop! Boop! Ouch! That hurt! Boop! Uh-oh! Maybe Mano shouldn't have done that. Uh-oh. <laughs> Squid and Mead! We've made it to our first boss chat. A, a big old blooper. Who's that something? Walk someone so cheese like that. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Somebody with some serious bucks in. That's who. Oh. Bloop, 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 bloop. Well, look at that! It's some saucy mustache guy! Sushi! Bloop the bloop! Bloop! These are the world apart. Oh, so yeah, here we have. Quite something. Bloop! 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 I'll give him a taste of the old tentacle trample! Hey, Mario! You remember that Professor Fankly told us? Oh, I. Oh, I just realized I forgot to put the badge on! Uh oh. So, uh, this might be a little tricky. <laughs> but yeah, we're, uh, we're on the first boss, a blooper. One of the only blooper, no, one of the only fightable bloopers in the game, actually. And it's a big old boy. That's a blooper, and a really super humongous one too. Ew, it's all slimy! Here we go. And, hey, make great sushi, though. <laughs> it's totally, I told, I just... Totally can't stand slimy, nasty, icky things. G R O S S, gross. And it's got twelve uh, and attack one. It's attack. It attacks with tentacles and ink. Ugh. Once you damage both its tentacles, it'll fall down and then it, uh, it's attack time. By the way, the tentacles each have three HP. Now relax, make some seafood out of that slimy, nasty blooper. Ah, uh, you heard her, chat. We gotta make some sushi. Now let's start by giving him a. Let's tenderize him a bit. Bloop. Oh, here it comes. Bloop, bloop. I must ask. Bloop, 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 bloop. You're thinking I'll taste good, aren't you? Wait a minute. Bloop. Bloop. Oop. Oop. Bloop. Bloop. Yeah, you want to snack on these tentacles, don't ya? Looks yummy. Where's my knife? Well, <laughs> apparently we can say, You're darn blooping, or you, I'd rather bloop. 
I'm, I'm seeing you. You seem pretty hung. I think you seem to want to snack on him. So yeah, you darn bloopin. Blue ha! Forget it. Here's a snack. I'm gonna bloop you so bad, you bloopin' bloop. Ah! Where's my knife? Uh, we don't. Don't worry. We don't need a. Who needs a knife? When you got a hammer, tenderize the meat. Does seafood count as meat? You know, I, I went to a seafood restaurant on while I was in New Jersey, and I somehow managed to get sick before the food got there. Ah! Yeah, I think uh, I think it was a combination of not having any breakfast that day and also having uh, way too many cokes. But. <laughs> I always do love a good blooper. Oh, actually, I just remembered. I actually have a blooper plush with me when I, I got it out for uh, the Nintendo Direct. So fun to bloopers. I should draw one sometime. Anyways, hammer time. Bloop. What you doing? I'm bad. Sauce in there, won't it? Yeah. Bloop. Of course, uh, if y'all are... Te uh, I'll, actually, I'll tell you in a moment. Although, definitely kind of cool how paper the paper craft look the uh, blooper has. Oh, dear. Ooh, that could have been bad. They look yummy. Ooh, you sure love your seafood. I mean, I quite, I quite like how bloopers look. They're making me hungry now. Bloop. What was that? Bloop, 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 bloop. But yeah, let's keep our hand run away, tenderize some blooper meat. I don't know if I've ever had squid before. I've, I've had shrimp and uh, scallops. I need to try takoyaki one of these days. I wonder if, if is there a squid equivalent? The bottle can broke you. Blah! Ah, ah, ink! Oh, well. Well, we've kind of seen all the blooper can do, so let's finish him off. <laughs> you bloop, 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 you bloop, 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 bloop. Oh, yeah! Oh, double star, double point. Sushi! Indeed. Oh. Uh, Bloop, 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 bloop. Well, and there he goes. Well, uh, that just happened. Indeed. Speaking of sushi, have y'all ever heard of the game? This game called uh, Sushi Strikers. It's this uh, puzzle game uh, where people fight by eating sushi and throwing plates at each other. It's a pretty hilarious game. My sushi. <laughs> Oh yeah, it got away. Oh well. But on the bright side, that concludes the prologue! And thus begins chapter one! Castle and Dragon! Oh boy, that sounds good. We we still got a good we still got a good uh, bit of time left, so let's keep on going, chat. Uh, don't worry, I'm I'm sure we'll find you some sushi eventually. <laughs> but yeah, welcome to Petal Metal Petal Meadows. Pretty flowery place. Well, here we are, the Petal Meadows, where folks say Crystal Star hides. Woohoo! Here we go, Mario! The start of our adventure. This is completely awesome! Oh, yeah. Also, I think. Can you smack the flowers? Yeah, but why would you? Sheep? A sheep? Where? Wait, where's the sheep? Did y'all say a sheep, or am I being crazy? Oh, mushroom. Oh, well. Oh, and we found our first star piece. Now, neat thing about star pieces in this game, aside from trading with that one guy, they actually unlock extras. If you, for you see, if you collect all the star pieces in one area, you'll unlock the sa you'll um, you'll be able to listen to, I think, soundtrack the soundtrack, and you'll get concept art that's never before seen. Well, yeah, let's uh, let's keep going. Where did you see the sheep? Oh, <laughs> no, th those are boulders, not sheep. Oh well, then. What was that? <laughs> oh my! It's a dirt. It's a dirt. Oh my gosh! It's a dirt again. <laughs> Supper time! <laughs> Whoa! What was that? Uh, I believe that was a big old dergen. <laughs> I've never seen anything like that. Before. That humongous before. It looked kind of scary too. Definitely flew into that castle there, right? Let's let's get going in case it comes back. Here we go again. So yeah, that so uh, 
I don't know anything about it. Dragons don't seem to show up too much in the Mario series. Ooh, it's got an indent. Seems, seems, not seems like there's much we can do here. But you, it's not too often we see dragons that big. You know, uh, dragon-sized dragons. So yeah, we'll, we'll be... Did that just blink? No. Oh, that's funny. They didn't blink in the original. But yeah, we got that dragons and oh, oh, what am I not? Yeah, I just remembered. Oh, I keep pushing the wrong button. I for I can't believe I forgot to equip the badge. There. Now we can use the power smash. And hey, look, I'm gonna test it out. What? But yeah, let's, uh, we got some Goombas. We'll go ahead and let Goombella deal with that thing. That first one. She thing! But yeah, quite, quite a start. And the Power Smash is basically hammer, but a lot heavier. Ah! It froze. Oh, and yes, it did, chat. Uh, there go the, uh, the internet. The internet has taken another dip. All right. Uh, did you see the new? Okay. Uh, did, did I see the new Pokemon episode? Oh yes, I did. Uh, is it is it still frozen or is the internet just getting? Is the, did the internet fix itself? Uh, okay. Well, while I wait for the uh, internet to come back, uh, I'll go say what I said. Yeah, I did see the new Pokemon episode, and oh boy, the revelations. <laughs> Yeah, our, our heroes have made it back to uh, Orange Academy, and ooh, we the villains be cooking up something. Did not know that uh, Ameth Amethio was the uh, grandson of the big bad. Uh, uh, what was his name? Gibeon? Something like that. I don't know. I just know he's got a shiny snake doggo. <laughs> we too. That's oh boy. I'm looking forward to see what they do next on uh, on Horizons. Garcia Murphy's Law. Yeah, Murphy's Law strikes again. We, we better start wrapping things up. But hey, what do we have here? Oh, look at that! It's a close call badge! Yeah, basically this makes it so when Mario is below half health, uh, he might, he can, enemies have a chance of missing. So let's go ahead and plop that on. Oh, and one more thing I'd like to show off. Uh, Y'all may remember we got a certain power called Sweet Treat. Hopefully I can show it off before it was, the internet completely goes up. But you see that star meter up here? Yeah, I'm good. Okay, good. Yeah, yeah. Let's uh, let's get things going before the internet completely cuts out. Oh, yep. But it's frozen on my screen again. I don't know why the internet does. Ah. Wait, is it still streaming or did it break? Oh, oh dear. Is anyone still there? Hello? Okay, okay, give me a moment, chat. I, I'm, I'm gonna try disconnecting and reconnecting. Uh, don't go anywhere. Uh, don't go anywhere, chat. I, I'll try to get this fixed in just a moment, because... Again, we, we do not have great internet over here. Come on. It froze again. I, I know. I'm, I'm working on it. Ugh. I wonder how this looks in the recording. Come on. Please reconnect. Oh, please. I only have a little bit. Hopefully this won't happen in future streams. I don't know why this game in particular is... Okay, are we back? Okay, we're back, and the delay is even worse now. <coughs> yep, okay, okay, We still, we got like a 40 second delay, a 49 second delay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna disconnect and reconnect real quick, chat, so uh, don't go anywhere, we're almost done, but I still have something important I need to ask y'all, so be right back. Um. Okay, the delay should stop soon. 
Okay, is anyone there? Are any anyone still there? Okay, um, yeah, I don't. I might have broke it. Okay, the delay. Okay, uh, just uh, chat when y'all are back. Let me know. Okay, uh, 20, 20, 19. I'm, I'm looking at the delay disappearing. Okay. Just uh, 10 more seconds. Okay, I think it should be good now, Chad. Are, are anyone there? Hello? Hello? Hey, we, uh, Chad, are you there? I, I have a sweet tweet treat I wish to share with you. Uh, yep. <clears throat> ah. <coughs> Curse you, Murphy's Law. Uh, we, when I get to 50 followers, definitely need to make an emote for that. <clears throat> Anyways, yo. So as I was trying to say, we now have this thing called the Sweet Treat. And if y'all notice, uh, we have an audience. We just have uh, some Goombas watching. And that will fill up that low star meter up there. This is similar to the star spirits from the first game, but now we use the audience to recharge. And now, you, by with the power of the mystical map, we now use the Sweet Treat! which summons the crystal stars, and we throw them to regain health and for Mario, his partner, and flower power. Uh, just gotta make sure not to hit the poison mushrooms. Uh, more Murphy's Law. Yeah, basically we just keep hitting hit these little treats, and they will be, and they'll heal us based on how much we get. So that that's always a good thing to have ready, especially in early game when you might not have, you might not have the most health and flower power. And there we go. But yeah, uh, we haven't gotten to our first level up yet, but we're getting close, chat. Though, ba based on how things have been going, I, I think we might want to start wrapping things up. But before, before, but don't go anywhere, chat, because I got some cool stuff I wish to show you and uh, ask you something about, because... If y'all remember from when I did Paper Mario 1, I did some cool stuff with Gimp where I tried to make a bestiary. I'm not gonna do it this time, but what I do want to do is uh, a little art challenge for myself. So, uh, yeah, if we go if we go over here, we got some cool stuff here. Such as an art gallery, which we can't access yet, but if we can get this, but, but yeah, if we uh, do get enough star pieces we can unlock some cool stuff we can also look at the crystal stars which we have none we can also look at the map which also tells us how many star pieces are or shine sprites are in the area yeah before our first star we're going after is the diamond star oh, yeah. we can also look at the badges we have but now anyways on to my point my one of my favorite things in any game a bestiary aka the tattelog which lets us look at basically all the enemies we've tattled so we got the goomba the paragoomba the spiky goomba as well as the spinia and finally uh, the blooper the big bad blooper boss so here's what the little art challenge i want to do chat I want y'all to pick one thing for me to draw, and I'm going to try to get that thing drawn before next Paper Mario stream, because uh, I really want to do some more Paper Mario art. You want sushi? <laughs> okay, so I'm assuming that means you want me to try to draw. You want me to try to draw the blooper. I, I don't think I'll draw him as sushi, but I can definitely try to draw the blooper. Make some blooper art. So yeah, it, basically I will try to draw this and then post it on DeviantArt before, uh, probably next Friday. I, 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 though, if I have it done before the next Paper Mario stream, I'll show it on here to y'all early, as well as post it on my Patreon early. Feel free to join. I, I'd post my, I kind of want to post a link to my Patreon here, but, uh, with how the, uh, with how the stream's been messing up, I, I don't know if anyone will see it, but I'll go ahead and get it real quick. 
In the meantime, chat, go ahead and decide on on uh, what what shall I be drawing for the first thing? Because I think once this once we're all done with this game, I'm going to take everything we draw or everything I draw for this and put it into one big old art piece. So, so, so chat, do you? Uh, you want me to draw the blooper? You want me to draw Mr. Big Sushi? Blooper? Alright, blooper it is! Alright. So, Alright, then let me just... Uh... Okay, so yeah, expect... So yeah, feel free to follow me on my DeviantArt, Blue Sharky 38 And uh, hopefully I will get a... A some art of this blooper done. Uh, shouldn't be... Shouldn't be too hard. I don't know if he'll look as 3D as he does here, but hey, expect some bloopers in the future. And do love me a good blooper. <laughs> but yeah, I also got a got an art poll going on right now. Uh, let me. So uh, yeah, let's uh, start wrapping things up. And also, I'm gonna go ahead and post a link to my Patreon if y'all want to join and get access to early art and work in progress and art polls if I ever get around to doing them. You don't have to join. It's just because honestly, just having y'all here watching is thanks enough. Thank I love y'all so much, and I, I want to keep making content. But yeah, let's uh, go ahead and wrap, th start wrapping things up. But yeah, but yeah, thanks, th thanks for hanging with us, Mario. Oh yeah, thank you so much for playing my new game. Uh, be sure to buy. If anyone hasn't already, please get Paper Mario Thousand Door for the Switch. So uh, you know, we can go on the more Paper Mario adventures in the future. Yeah, totally. Uh, nice, nice to see you. All. Hey, Goombella. Uh, Goombella, it's nice to see you again. Totally. But yeah, let's uh, go ahead and wrap things up. So, uh, see you all next time. Laters. Bye bye. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching. I'll try to get that blooper art started. Feel free to stop by my Demon Art Blue Sharky 38 if you want to vote on my on what art poll I'm working on. In the mean, and of course, uh, tune in tomorrow. We're going to be doing the Mochi Mayhem epilogue on Pokemon Violet. It's going to be quite crazy. Yeah, you don't want to miss it. It's going to be great. Uh, you and you better be back for tomorrow. It's going to be great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, totally, bruh. It won't be as cool as Poke Paper Mario, but you know. Yeah, we know, bruh, but it'll still be totally awesome. Yeah. Well, mo Mochi. Indeed. Farewell, my friends. Have a most pleasant rest of the evening. Until the next time, tomorrow, we shall uh, go hunting for Mochi. Or, or, or something. So says I, Silky! Say it all, comrades. Have, good, have a good night, and see you then for more Pokemon fun. <laughs> but, uh, I'll see y'all next time. Tomorrow, hopefully. Ciao!